What's up everybody, welcome back. Headed up here to the mountains today to do some fishing. We got the kayak, we're gonna take it out and see if we can't catch some bass. So guys, let's just jump into it. Let's get, let's get in here and see what happens. I gotta drag this kayak down here. It's gonna be, I ain't never put my kayak in up here, but we're gonna try. All right guys. Well everybody, we're up here unloading the kayak. Can y'all hear that? Those are those cicadas. They're out, that brood X cicadas. It's funny because they're up here, they're not at the house yet. Those are the weirdest sounding cicadas. Like everybody, I, I've seen on forums and everything on, on Facebook, everybody's like, oh, they're the same cicadas. They're no different. Dude, those cicadas sound way different. Listen to that. I got out of the car and I was like, what is that? I thought my car was making like some weird noise or thought something was messing up. No, it's those damn cicadas. They're everywhere up here in the mountains. They make the weirdest sound. All right, guys, let's get down here in the river. Look at this, guys. These little casings everywhere, all over this tree. And I see one right here. It's getting ready to come out. Look at it. New cicada, but there's little casings. These little casings are everywhere. So cool they've started to come out up here. I mean, they're all over the place. Listen to that sound. Look at this cicada. He's coming out, making his emergence. He's been in the ground for 17 years. It's crazy to think how much younger a man I was when he was conceived and come out. I mean, listen to that sound. All right, guys, let's get, let's get on the water. Look, we have another one that's already come out. Look at that. I don't know one thing, it's gonna be hard filming this year with the sound. It's gonna get worse too, all right guys. So that sound, that's so crazy. Man, that's weird. Thumbnail action going on. That was the weirdest sound. I think it's the first time I've ever had this thing in moving water. I'm gonna have to walk all the way back up this. It's gonna suck. No way I can paddle back up this. Don't suck. Mm -hmm. That's good stuff. Oh, Lord. About ate it right there. About ate it, boys. We didn't know. <laughs> we about did, though. We about ate it. But we didn't. We just about did. Peaceful. It's weird they're less loud over here. It's like more back that way. They all come out so much in one little spot. I don't hear them that bad down here by the river, main river. Back over there, though, they're everywhere. Well, so far we ain't caught nothing. I thought I'd be able to fish that area a lot slower than I did, but... The water's pushing through there. You really can't fish it that fast. I mean, that slow. Cool thing is, I can sit down. I can just take it. There's a cicada in the water right there. 
and it's snagged up. Look at him. There he is. I'm curious. He's already made it in the water. I'm watching how they act in the water. Because I think it's, it's they just now coming out. They probably just started coming out last night. These bass and everything haven't quite figured them out yet. What's going to be... I mean, they do. I mean, they're used to cicada this year, but... There's going to be a topwater gourd going down. Let's take a look at the cicada. If I can. I should have took off earlier. Let's see if we can get a look at this guy. They're harmless. They're just ugly. They're harmless. They're just ugly. He's already made his faith. I can't let him go down like it after 17 years of being on the ground. Let's look at these guys. Listen. Look how much different he looks than the regular ones. I don't have one of those to compare him to, but maybe we can find a picture. Let's listen to him. Hear him? Oh shoot, we're losing our head. Let's let him. Here, let's just put him on us. I'm all over the place here. This guy's headed to the north. They're just a big ugly bug, but they don't really... They're harmless. They are harmless. Whoop, there he goes, right back in the water. He can't fly yet. This is the way my bear. He's not a good flyer. Ah, uh, this is freaking annoying. Supposed to make this adventure more relaxing. Seems to be making it more of a pain in the ass. I just got out of the car and get wet a little bit. I don't even care. I'd rather get wet laying my jig in. Oh, nice and wet now. But yeah, let's take a look at the cicada buddy here. He's getting deep fried up here. He's cool looking. Oh, I hear fish over there, Jazz. See if we throw him up if he flies away. Let's try it. He might be too wore out. Look at him, there he goes. See you, buddy. You better live on. Uh oh. He's starting to. No, he's going. Live on, my friend. He gone. I'll be darned. Hey, for the show, buddy. Somewhere down the line, there'll be a whole generation of those things. But oh me, their life. <laughs> There's one. Nope. False alarm. Stick. I don't want to come out. God. Story of my life. There's a fish. Finally. I threw it out there and let it set. I knew there had to be a fish right there. Oh, that's a good one. In the boat. Nice little small mouth. He's right there on that bank. I kind of thought they would. I had to throw it in there and paddle backwards. Let's check his guy out. Oh, chill out, you ornery thing. He's a little guy, but he's not too bad at all. I'll take him. I ain't caught nothing yet. Oh, he's so pretty. Look how beautiful he is. Dark. That's pretty, man. He is super pretty. Back up just a little bit. Look at that beautiful fish. Let's let him go. Let's watch him go down here. See you, buddy. See you, buddy. Let's put that net right there. I noticed those cicadas sound doesn't carry very far. It's real localized where they're all coming up. I'd say here soon, though. In a week, it's going to be loud everywhere. 
because those guys are just coming out. New to the world. It's too windy. The water's flowing in too hard. I'd rather be in the water. There's one. That's a good one. There we go. I got out of the kayak. Big ones behind it. I got out of the kayak because it's just blowing me around too much. It's trying to get into my spot. It's not super big. He had a good one behind him. Real good one behind him. But, yeah, I got out of my kayak, guys, because the wind was just blowing me into my spot. I couldn't rather just stand out here fish and paddle a hundred times scare the fish away look at that. he's a little guy he's very big he felt monstrous when he hit but still not so small mouth let's let him go where's he going i'm following him let's see where he goes and where the fish are so yeah I just popped out of this thing because you know what i mean you gotta get out of it Keep me just sitting in that kayak blowing around. There's one. There's a good one. Trying to find out where they're sitting at. They're sitting over there. That's better than that other one. That's a pretty good one. Oh, sorry guys, I got you on my angle in. Trying to bring him in now. Beautiful small mouth. Better than that other one, much better looks to be oh, come on now goodness gracious alive. fishing ain't all fun and game sometimes it's frustrating actually it's a lot of frustration I think that's the misleading part of YouTube fishing is the amount of frustration getting snagged on stuff and caught and stuff it is a sport it's not easy Look at that guy. Beautiful, beautiful smallmouth. Awesome, look at that guy. Lovely. Let's let him go. No Mondos today, but beautiful fish nonetheless. Get back over here, guy. I'm trying to creep in my honey hole. My wind is not my favorite. That's why I got out of that thing. I'll just be sitting there paddling around like a hot dog in the water. And I wasn't about that life. I'm trying to actually catch some fish. I ain't about that hot dog life. I'm about that fish life. Fish over here, really. That's it. Insta snag. I'm just looking around over here, getting a lay for what the land looks like or the water. Oh God, there's a big butter over here. He's gigantic. God, I hate those spiders. They just like to set it all logs on the water. Do I got a fish? I do got a fish. What the hell? It was a snag. I swear. What the hell just happened? I bet you I got snagged. Oh my God, that was like sensory overload right there. Holy cow. Oh, oh my God, that was weird. See, it's kind of like stuff like that. I kind of wish I had the camera on my head so y'all could see more angles, which I need cameras around and I don't. But um, I got snagged and I went to go towards a piece of wood and there's this huge spider there. And he freaked me out and I pushed back and I guess that smallmouth went to that log. 
seen that vibrating on it and or that whatever it was stuck in and plucked it off and ate it just let him go <laughs> what a weird fish so i guess i'm gonna head back towards the car head back towards the car guys because i've caught a i don't know i caught four i think i'm not sure how many i caught nothing gigantic today but some good fish just would really like to get on that big one but may not happen here where I eat it right here guys I'm gonna eat it right here getting that kayak out dragging it up the hill i may show some of that video in here but all right guys i appreciate y'all for watching man those cicadas those guys are crazy and they're coming out everywhere i hope i got some cool footage of those the sound's gonna be crazy this year the audio and video but i appreciate y'all for watching we were able to get four i think four or five smallmouth nothing too big but heck it was a good day guys i appreciate y'all for watching don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and as always i'll see y'all guys later We'll be back real soon. All right, guys.